Okay, welcome to the tutorial guys. Quick tutorial on how to add a percentage to a list price on say if you own an e-commerce store online and you have a bunch of products that have uh, your vendor price, the price you're paying for the product and you'd like to mark it up for a retail price. I'm going to show you in Excel how to just a simple equation to be able to take a whole bulk list of prices and um, change them you know very easily so you'll copy in your vendor prices which I did in column A here and then use click in column B and you're gonna go up to your little formula area and hit equal sign we want A2 which is right here times which is also the star and on whatever percentage you want. Uh, we want a 40% markup on this, so we'll put 0 0.4. If you want a 50% markup, you could put 0 0.5. If you want 40, 41.5, you can go 41.415 like that. Uh, but pretty much you can mark up however you'd like on that. But we're going to just, since 40% 40, 40 it's 0.4. Uh, after you do that, you go ahead and click, click the, uh, the check mark. It will actually calculate it for you. Now, to step and repeat all the way down, you're going to take this little box right here and simply drag it and keep dragging it until you run up with the left column. There is also an easier way you can copy and paste. I didn't know there was 3,000, 4,000 products in this one. So now that we're coming, I think there's probably 4,000 in this. Yeah. Okay, so after we let go of it, it now calculated that 40% markup and the entire second column. Now this is just the markup price, so we don't want to use this. This is not our retail price. That's what uh, we're going to mark. That's 40% more than what, that's 40% of what column A is. So what we need to do in column C is equal sign. Uh, we want A2, we want, which is column A, which is our list price, vendor price, what we pay for it, and we want to add the 40% markup. So we're going to add B2. And go ahead and hit the check mark. And now this will be our uh, retail price that you can put inside your spreadsheet and upload to your e commerce store. Uh, that's it for the tutorial. Pretty straightforward. Column A will have this uh, equation. And then column C here, I accidentally clicked on it. And then in column C will have this equation. And this is your retail prices right here. And this one is your markup. Hope this helped you guys out. Uh, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, and please subscribe to my channel. I'll be having a lot more uh, tutorials to help you guys out. Thank you so much.